So we finally have it, a car from Hyundai Motor India, the Hyundai Group in fact, made in India that has managed to not just go for five stars here, but also has done it with the stricter protocol with a lot more requirements and a lot more stringent testing criteria. The Koreans have done it at last and the one to do it is the Hyundai Verna. The Made in India compact sedan is the first from a Korean manufacturer to finally score five stars in a global NCAP crash test. The Verna underwent voluntary testing and has achieved five stars with a robust score for both adult occupant protection and child occupant protection as well. This vehicle has a lot of uh, technologies and uh, safety systems. Uh, for example, like the six airbags, which are fitted as standard. And that means a huge jump forward for the manufacturer in order to offer the uh, Indian consumers basic safety, as in the other markets, not just by the equipment, but also by good performing in the vehicle. The Verna also underwent a side impact protection test. While here too, the body shell has to absorb impact, having certain equipment as standard, like those curtain airbags, makes all the difference. The more stringent protocols also means more stringent testing. So it's not just about frontal offset. As you know, going for a five-star score also requires many other components and many other facets to be covered, including a pole test, which is what this one went through. Let's see how that went. A good score with the pole test is necessary to secure five stars, and the Verna has managed that well. A car must also have other features like Isofix child seat anchors and ESC or electronic stability control, which also add to the overall scoring. And so the Verna was also tested for high speed stability and pedestrian protection too. The biomechanical readings show that the adult dummies have marginal injuries only. The performance in the side impact and pole tests was also good. Protection for infants and small children was also very good. Now a car can score five stars in a crash test and yet have certain things that could still be pointed out as being lacking or missing. In the case of the Verna, the structure has still been rated as unstable. Let's understand what that means. The reason why this car was rated with an unstable structure is basically because we have three load paths, the roof, the door and the lower seal. And in this case, the car doesn't have a load path in the, row, in the door. We only have on the roof and, the, and also in the seal. And in both cases, we have seen uh, signals that those, system, those areas of the car will uh, probably suffer more deformation under higher loads. That's the reason why it was rated as an unstable structure. But that doesn't mean that the structure is conditioning the rest of the performance. The most important thing and what we count as the basic of the calculations is the biomechanical results. So if we are seeing a good protection, a good biomechanical results, low levels of injuries, that explains why the car got scored so high. The Verna joins the Volkswagen Virtus and Taigun, Škoda Slavia and Kushak with five stars for both adult and child protection under the new, more stringent global NCAP protocol. The Mahindra Scorpio N also has five stars, but only for adult occupant protection. Now, on the whole, this demonstrates a huge improvement in terms of uh, the techniques, uh, the manufacturing process that Hyundai is now adopting and also the change or shift in strategy and attitude for cars that are made in India. And given the fact that a lot of these cars are also now going to be exported out of India, this also bodes well for the entire group's operation, not just the Hyundai brand.